But it seems like right now, everybody who's moving to Nashville is moving here from Los Angeles. It's no different with the Titans' newest acquisition, wide receiver Robert Woods. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having me. We're glad you're here. <laughs> yeah. Now, here's what I got to know. We've got a couple of local guys on the Rams roster, Van Jefferson and Jalen Ramsey. Have you and Alexandra hit them up for local knowledge yet? Jalen Ramsey uh, reached out right away, uh, told me, welcome to the 615. You have one of the best nicknames in the NFL, <laughs> Bobby Trees. Yeah. Do you like the nickname, and who gave it to you? I uh, love the nickname. It really started off in, in Buffalo. A uh, few of the fans had it had it going, and uh, used to call me Bobby Trees when I was there. Really just blew up when I went to L.A., had the alter ego. Really just ran with it and bring it here to Tennessee. All right, let's talk about uh, the fact that the last game you played before your injury was actually against Tennessee. Yeah. You played great in that game. You had seven that. catches for 98 yards. So you know this team. Yeah. You know what they're about. Give me your thoughts on the Titans from the outside and now what Robert Woods, Bobby Trees, hopes to bring to the inside. Really uh, being able to watch Tennessee over the past few years, uh, what they've been doing, being a consistent team, being right there in the mix, making the, making the playoffs, uh, having a, the leading rusher, uh, coach of the year. So really just a, already a, a dominant team and then really just being able to play them uh, on the offensive side and seeing what they did up front with, with Simmons. Uh, Bayard being able to uh, make a nice interception to the house and uh, really just to come here and join this this team that's already built and sound and be able to add my game to it, uh, my excitement, my, my plays, my physicality, uh, whether it is in the pass game, the run game, um, without the ball, uh, I feel like all these factors and joining this team will make this team dynamic and uh, really just excited to get on the field and, and make these plays and, and, and tear it up and do it here with these guys in, in Nashville. One of the common threads throughout your career is you've always played with other good receivers. Marquise Lee in high school and college, yes. Sammy Watkins, Brandon Cooks, and now obviously Cooper Cup, some yeah. backs who could catch, some tight ends who yeah. could catch. Why have you always thrived in that sort of setting? Team. I would say uh, really it's all about the team and it's not about thriving by yourself. And that really played a factor in my decision coming here when, when the trade offers um, came about. It was joining a good back, having Derrick Henry, uh, obviously having a great quarterback, Tannehill, being able to spread the ball around, having A.J. Brown on the other side, very dynamic, does it, does it all downfield. I think joining him, uh, I think it's a, a deadly combo. Can't wait to get with him. Um, I know it's going to be defenders who are very uh, – Scared to tackle us when we get that ball in our hands. You were a very young man when you came out of USC. Your first five years in the league, you put up good numbers. The last four years, you exploded. Why have you continued to improve throughout the course of your career in that way? Honestly, the, the opportunities. Being able to, to come in the league and get right away with, with the Buffalo Bills and uh, really was able to join up with McVay and get in that offense where he wants to showcase my, my talents, be able to have the ball in my hands. And you see that production take off. And coming here with Todd Downing in this offense, the receivers, the quarterbacks, uh, the running backs, I think it's, it's going to be the same story. Just being able to, to get that ball in my hands and, and be comfortable in making plays in, in the NFL. You have been called the best blocking wide receiver in the NFL. That's arguable. I mean, some other guys <laughs> would take that. But you have been called that. You obviously take it seriously. Who got you to take blocking so seriously? And why is it such a big point of pride to Robert Woods? Yeah, I would say really uh, growing growing in the NFL, being out there and having to find ways to work without the ball. As receivers, we love to make these exciting plays. You see your running back running past you uh, down the field and you're that key block. Uh, Want to be able to do that here with Derrick Henry. He has the speed. Uh, just got to get him his, his first four steps in the ground and I mean, he's, he's rolling. I think the receivers are, are play a key aspect in, in that blocking. You're also known as a great teammate. And you were in Buffalo. You left there a popular guy. You're leaving Los Angeles a popular guy. Your teammates in Tennessee are excited about you. Thank you for everything, Woody. That's from the receiver who just had the most productive season of anybody in NFL history. What does Cooper Cup saying that about Robert Woods mean to you? Hearing it from, from your teammate is, is a, a crazy perspective because all you're doing is just putting in the grind and the work with your brothers and then to hear it, how you really impact them um, and leaving your mark, leaving your, your footprints, your handprints on the team and the organization um, is, is a tremendous feeling because it's 
a long lasting impact. We welcome all of our LA brothers and sisters who are moving to Nashville. We especially welcome you, your wife Alexandra, your daughter Shy. Glad to have you as a tight, tighten up, Robert. A little tighten up. <laughs>